Hi, my name is Chris Crutcher, and I'm the author of Period 8. A lot of what Period 8 is about is about what goes on in people's lives and, and what capacity they have to be able to tell the truth about it. The subject of truth comes up a lot in Period 8, and it comes up particularly in, in, in the arena of cheating of, of, and, and you're an adolescent, so you've got, you've got the, the commitment piece of some of the characters up against evolution, up against, up against hormones, up against biology. I think the truth is subjective. There's a, there's a place in the story where the main character talks about these kind of two visions of the truth. One is a, an old H.L. Mencken uh, saying, and, and I'll, I'll, get, I'll get close to it. He basically says, for every complex problem, there's a simple answer, and it's wrong. And the other is a, uh, a scene that comes from um, All the Pretty Horses, where the main character in, pretty, in All the Pretty Horses says, there ain't but one truth, there's just what happened. Well, the character in the story is caught between those two places because what he did when, when he cheated wasn't, wasn't what he expected it to be. He wasn't looking around for... He wasn't sneaking around. He, he gets into a situation that by the time he knows how to control it, it's finished. And he struggles with whether or not he's going to tell. And he does. And it costs. Paul Baum's a little different from a lot of characters that I've created. But he's a guy who really wants to do the right thing. He has a father who, who has not a very successful marriage with his mom. His parents are much better parents than they are mates. And he's, he is looking into his own future, and he doesn't want to you know, be with a partner the way his mom and dad are together. So he's, he's painfully aware of what can happen, and he wants to do it right, and he wants to tell the truth. And he falls back into that dilemma that I talked about earlier, which is, when do I tell it, and what is it? So he's, he's a little more removed emotionally than some of my other characters, but I like him because his you know, his commitment to leading a decent life, lead, leading a, a respected life uh, is, is pretty great.